Um, I've decided that I'm gonna be neither because I take moral objection to playing a slaver empire. In fact, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna create a new custom empire for this stream. Show, show that process off a little bit and try and take a more, um, step-by-step -step comprehensive approach to how one sets themselves up for success in Stellaris. Space brains. Okay, so, um, here we have the ability to pick our, um, species traits. Uh, the way this works is that we have two points to spend on positive traits, which we can balance out with negative traits, but we only have five picks total. So, for example, if we wanted to go with Intelligent, we don't have any more positive trait points pick... trait pick... We don't have any more left. We have to pick some negative traits. So, for instance, if we want to add more positive things, we would have to go with, like, for instance, non-adaptive. Which means that it's harder to colonize other planets. It should be noted that you can't pick traits that are like um, in complete opposition to one you already have because that would just be stupid. You can't be non-adaptive and adaptive at the same time. They would just cancel each other out. So let's go with this. Intelligent but non adaptive traditional quick learners. Let's say that we start out on an ocean world. Plantoid City, because I kind of like how that looks. Oh, 
All right, now we get to pick what our government is going to be like. <clears throat> First, we have to pick our ethics. If I was making space elves, I would have picked the space elf option with the pointy ears. We have one. See? Space elves. Anyway, so we have options for ethics. We could be xenophobic, militarist, spiritualist, authoritarian, xenophile, pacifist, or materialist. Much like how you can't have traits that are in polar opposition to each other, you can't have ethics that are in polar opposition to one, either, one another either. You can't be simultaneously xenophobic and xenophilic. And you can't be simultaneously militarist and pacifistic. If we so desired, we could pick Gestalt Consciousness, which um, enables the Hive Mind Authority. But that's sort of... that's a little esoteric for our purposes. Alright, so the chat has a pretty... The chat has a pretty, um strong affinity towards xenophilia so let's pick with Xen let's go with xenophile for now and so we have two ethics points left if we wanted to we could become fanatic xenophiles which takes up two ethics points but makes our xenophile bonuses stronger All right, do not do pacifism. Pacifism is boring. Noted. We could be spiritualists if we wanted to be. We could also be egalitarian, which is interesting because it completely locks off two um, types of government, dictatorial and imperial. getting some conflicting messages from the chat. They want me to be space communists, which is actually sort of difficult in here. There's not really a good um, communism analog. Egalitarian is more um, focused on the democratic aspects of egalitarianism rather than the um, more uh, class struggle focused philosophies of leftism and communism but it's it's better than the alternative so it seems that we've decided on xenophile egalitarian spiritualists we can either be an oligarchy or a democracy Um, oligarchies are basically democracies that the player ex exercises a little bit more control over While democracies are a bit more chaotic and things change a lot, but it has a couple of unique bonuses. So let's go with democracy. Um, we are apparently a theocratic republic. And now that we have all of that sorted out, we can choose our civics.
since we have quite a few, um, we have quite a few different ethics with us. We have simultaneously a pretty big um, selection of civics to choose from. fairly basic, like mining guilds gives you empire minerals production plus 10%, which is boring, but just useful. Meritocracy, which increases the letter, leader level cap and leader pool size. Life seated, which is um, quite the difficult playstyle. You start as a perfect Gaia world, but your um, species has um, the tendency to only only be able to settle on Gaia World, so expansion rapidly becomes a problem. Functional architecture just makes your buildings cheaper, which is useful. Free Haven makes alien migration attraction better. I've always been a fan of efficient bureaucracy because I sort of hate sectors, but um, it lets you have two more core systems. Cutthroat politics um, reduces edict cost. Oh, for fuck's sake, um, uh, I have a phone call. One sec. Rumble. Okay, I'm back. Hello. Alright, I think that just to go along with our general theming here, we're gonna pick Beacon of Liberty, which increases monthly unity, and Free Haven, which increases alien migration attraction. about it. Um, I have heard that the xenophile announcer is fairly amusing, so let's let's roll with that for a while. We might go back to the original if it proves to be overwhelming. Sure, let's go with the Sildor Confederation. Thank God for the randomization option. Now, of course, this part is very important. We have to design our flag. We have a wide variety of um, designs and sigils to, pr to choose from that are sort of vaguely um, placed in categories. Some of them are fairly esoteric, like just nice patterns or planets or whatever, or like a nice person. Kind of like that one. Or a flower. Everybody likes flowers. You can also have the paradox lizard if you want. Or you can be a pirate. Uh, let's go with this, actually. It's 
looks like a person, but the person is also a torch. Um, now we get to choose our ship appearance, which is entirely cosmetic. Um... Let's go with molluscoid ships for something different. I kind of like their designs. Okay, we're purple, so we can be Space Night Elves. I, you can't have an entire species of Popes. It doesn't work that way. Start, with, start the game with these guys. Um, for the purposes of this, I'm actually going to play on the lowest difficulty, just so I can be as comprehensive as possible, and not have to deal with any particular crises. Uh, everything else looks about standard. are advised by our most learned priests. Let's take stock of the situation. So, generally speaking, game, it's best to prioritize um, getting more um, actual production going than science. Like, you want science, of course, but um, you need an economy with which to do things. Oh, there we are. <laughs> So we'll want to go for those minerals first before we um, get the engineering points. Uh, nanomechanics is technically under um, our scientist specialty, but it's not that useful. Let's go with coil guns instead. It'll take longer, but it's important to have a contemporary military, even if you don't plan to go for extremely expansionist policies. about democratic empires that should be noted. Leaders have ruler traits. Like, for instance, our current space pope has the explorer trait, which makes science ships cheaper and anomaly research speed faster. 
and Home in the Sky, which makes various star-based stuff cheaper. Um, there is also the fact that Democratic leaders have mandates. They will run on platforms that need to be fulfilled, and if you, if you complete them, you get unity for it. So, we want to build four research stations. In the next ten years, that shouldn't be too difficult. and build another science ship. We will take our existing ship and have it go explore. We're also going to punch up the speed a little bit. So we appear to be hanging out in the northeasternish quadrant of the galaxy. And I don't have much more to say about that. Construction complete. Because we don't know much about it yet. That's why I'm building science vessels. Construction complete. Alright, our mining station is done. And in the general interest of what I said earlier about increasing our economy before anything else, let's go ahead and build a energy mining station over this gas giant. Now we enter the stage of the game where we just mostly wait for bars to fill up to see what we find in other systems. System survey complete. Construction complete. So since we are an empire that is dedicated to um, egalitarianism and xenophilia and all that good stuff, Wrong thing, sorry. We want to um, proceed under the assumption that we probably won't be getting into too many fights. Like, as always, we want to have a strong, or at least serviceable standing military to deal with piracy and any belligerent factors, but I don't think military conquest Anomaly is found. going to be really part of the game System plan. survey complete that be for now. 40% is way too high. Mm 
around here, which is sort of a shame since we chose Ocean World as our starting point, but I'm not clairvoyant, so sometimes that's just how it goes. I'm sure we'll find something. System survey complete. Alright, now that our scientist is level 2, I'm more comfortable having her research that anomaly. Since everything in our home system has been constructed, we should start considering expanding. And we have a couple of systems that are fairly rich in energy and minerals around here, so... Situation log updated. We're not high enough level to research that special project yet, so we'll have to come back to it. Regular. Science ship taking damage. So, um, basically five feet from our home world, we have an Ether Drake. Let's get a nice good look at it. Um, that science ship is probably dead. Which is unfortunate, but sometimes that's just how it goes. The Aether Drake is a Leviathan class entity. As such, it has um, scary skull level military power. Science ship tragically lost. Rest in pieces. So, uh, we know to avoid that particular system for now. System survey complete. Regrettably, the Aether Drake is immediately hostile to basically everything. Including utterly harmless science ships. So we will have to dedicate some resources to getting a new one. Construction complete. Um on the on the whole That's actually good because um the Aether Drake, when defeated, has some very strong passive benefits that it gives to an, gives to an empire. So, we should definitely consider dealing with it at some point, but not until we're much much stronger. All right, since we're a little bit behind on um, surveying stuff because of a tragic loss of the science vessel. Let's adopt the discovery policy, which makes anomaly fail risk lower and anomaly discovery chance higher. Construction complete. Uh, 
we can't afford a new scientist just yet, so that science ship will just have to chill for a while. Alright, we've started the first laid quest, which is just looking for various precursor artifacts. Situation log updated. Anomaly found! Give that B for now. Level 3 is still a little too high. System survey complete. That's true, but we didn't pick the fanatic xenophile civic, so we don't have that ability to build habitats right on the Leviathan. All right, we finally have enough energy to recruit a new leader. Our new scientist somewhere that is not the detective. Construction system. complete. terrifying leviathans in immediate friendly space situation log updated but there is always a chance that we will in which case um, I've already prepared funeral expenses for our scientists complete. System survey complete. Various science vessel related expenditures have left us kind of poor on the front of minerals, but we'll be okay. Hopefully we can find an anomaly or two that might jumpstart our economy a little bit. Basically, the big watermarks are when you hit over 90 minerals so you can build something. <laughs> or when you just randomly find an Ether Drake, I guess. <laughs> Usually they're not quite so close. Construction complete. Well, that will be online sooner or later once that population finishes growing. 
One of these days I'll get better about System thinking survey those complete. Up. Construction complete. Um, because we have a mandate to build orbital research stations, I think I might leave that four energy B for now. And expand down towards the Geronth system, where there are two stations I could build. is proceeding apace. System survey complete. System survey complete. Now, we don't necessarily want to go on an expansion frenzy as our current type of empire. It can become a little bit difficult to sustain. But we obviously at least want to have enough worlds to fill up our core sector limit. Anomaly found. Research complete. Situation log updated. Any special projects that I'm leaving unresearched can be safely assumed to be beyond our science. System ability. survey complete. I know that all of the ones that are sort of in tandem with the first league quest are all like level 4 or 5, so for now they're beyond our reach. Survey speed is probably the most useful, since we're so early on. Construction complete. Construction complete. Mandates can sort of... Oh, one sec. Mandates can make you go a little bit out of your way, just in terms of how you expand and which systems you go to, but for the most part, the bonus to Unity is more than worth it. Mm -hmm. 
it's hard to squeeze in enough um, money for uh, more military units at the beginning of the game, but it's good to have a sort of steady build up so you can deal with the pirates that will inevitably come and mess with you. System survey complete. Construction complete. Construction complete. Right. System survey complete. Once we have the minerals, we can start working on getting those science stations up and running. Anomaly found. All right, currently we have the lowest society research, so we should probably get the society research station going first. Research complete. Um, the thing about spiritualists is they get access to a special um, subclass of buildings called temples. Temples are a lot like Autocathon monuments from the base game, except um, they're more unique and they're more effective, and they increase spiritualist ethics attraction. We have an energy surplus at the moment, so I think another science vessel is in order, because I love those things, and knowing my luck, both of mine will immediately blow up. Situation log updated. Construction complete. Construction complete. When faced with a choice of scientists that don't have Anomaly any found. overwhelmingly useful traits, I just tend to go with the youngest one because having scientists that live longer is less of a hassle. Fleeing aggressors. Oh, it's just more space amoebas. Our science vessel should be able to flee from that pretty easily. We should be able to research that project. Alright, the 
Tesla has evaded certain doom, so I'm grateful for that. System survey complete. Let's go ahead and research that project, see what we get. Construction complete. Alright, then we have about three years to construct one more science station, so... Let's not dally. Research complete. Special project complete. Uh, the question is, do we want exoskeletons or geothermal fracking? They both sort of give the same thing, more minerals. Powered exoskeletons will require less investment to come online, so let's go with them. Great! Wonderful! I love it! vessel. with these. Uh, two should be fine for now. I should focus on, after I get this science station, I should focus on beefing up my economy. System survey complete. System survey complete. Construction complete. Well, on the bright side, we should fulfill our mandate with time to spare. Um, the databank uplinks perk, uh, perk is pretty nice, it, just not right now, so let's go with the extra research alternative. And then to leader experience gain, into faith and science, which gives you even more unity. I 
tend to focus a lot on Unity because I like all of the Ascension perks and stuff. Anomaly found! Sure, let's research this and immediately blow up. System survey complete. As for Space Pope, Juliet as Lopez's mandate, additional research stations have been constructed, and we get 50 unity for that. So now we don't have to worry about that for another couple years. It's nice when they have orbital mining mandates, because you just sort of get those automatically. Every system will have at least one system survey um, complete mineral or energy deposit. Construction complete. Tile blocker cleared. Okay, we finally found um, evidence of another empire, not just space dragons. are proving to be particularly um, juicy looking for expansion. But I'll have to expand eventually, so I'll just have to suck it up. Maybe just make it less of a priority than I normally do. Research complete. Anomaly found. that in mind, I will research blue razors, blue lasers, instead of enhanced colony ships. I'm having trouble speaking today, like every day. More than one system survey yet. complete. Construction complete. System survey complete. Construction complete. I am pretty sure that um, translating the alien mural has no potentially disastrous effects. Thank <laughs> you. 
Construction complete. But maybe they do, and maybe we'll learn about them presently. Sure, this one, this one sounds nice. Forming a federation with them. Construction complete. Special project complete. system is quite rich in both um, mineral and scientific resources, so we should consider going there at some point. You just have to um, make a sort of ring of containment around the ether Construction drain. complete. Research complete. Alright, that's helpful. That increases our minerals by a little bit. Construction complete. System survey complete. Alright, so it's been long enough that we are now electing a new ruler. Construction complete. If we so desired, we could um, support one candidate with some influence. Seems like everybody's pretty evenly matched here. So I decided to spend a little influence to pick somebody who had the off-world minor mandate because that's much easier to fulfill than orbital research does mean we need to find a new scientist. Holly 
Polytechnic Education, which increases leader experience gain by 25%, will help offset the <laughs> considerable costs I have incurred in um, scientists, because they will gain levels faster and reach efficacy sooner. System survey complete. So there is a natural wormhole in that system. Which could make it, um... Strategically significant. Construction complete. But I also don't care that much, and the ether drake is kind of in the way, so we'll see. Construction complete. System survey complete. For the time being, we can't do anything with um, a natural wormhole because we don't have the technology System to survey complete. And it. Construction complete. All right, so we have our first faction. They call themselves the Individual Choice Council. Their members work for equality and justice for all denizens of our empire. And they're quite happy with us, so we get um, plus 2.5 influence per month. Let's take a look and see what their issues are. They're anti-autocratic, free movement, reproductive freedoms, and anti-caste. We fulfill literally all of these, so they love us. Assuredly, we will eventually get factions that do not. And we'll deal with that when we deal with that, I guess. Um, it's always good to find a primitive civilization, because they give a lot of society research for not a lot of investment. Construction complete. System survey complete. Construction complete. Okay, we already fulfilled the minor mandate, so we don't have to worry about that for quite some time now. I told you that one was easy. <laughs> Um, our economy is expanding at a pretty good rate. Anomaly found. We should consider, um, building another ship or two, I think, because we're probably going to get pirates pretty soon. Construction complete. System survey complete. Pirates are just ridiculously annoying. I don't mind failure. It's the critical failures that kind of get me down. Alright, well, 
The science ship is sort of in a bad spot. It's caught between a space amoeba and an ether drake. Fortunately, we're on good terms with the other empire here, so we can just pass through their borders, I think. System survey complete. Construction complete. Construction complete. moment I'll probably build another science vessel. Send it into the meat grinder. Anomaly found. Construction complete. Construction complete. Yep, yep, I expected that. Now we just need to see from whence they are coming. System survey complete. Spaceport under attack. Fleeing aggressors. Oh, looks like um, they're having research their own complete. problems with piracy. Construction complete. <laughs> Fortunately, the first round of pirates are like really bad at actually dealing with um, even the most basic of space stations, so this is mostly just cleanup. Research complete. Now I just gotta find their base and blow Fleeing it up. Fleeing aggressors. Handshake protocols activated. Agree. Um, let's 
Let's see, what should we study? We're a little low on society research, so maybe biodiversity studies will help. Oh, and we're losing food. I should fix that. Anomaly found! Battling Aggressor Station. Construction complete. System survey complete. but whatever. Aggressors spotted. Spaceport under attack. There are a lot of pirates this game for whatever reason. I don't think I've ever encountered Handshake this protocols many. activated. I agree to the non-aggression pact. I have no interest in war with these nice fellows. Construction complete. Construction complete. Research complete. Might as well recruit an admiral, make sure things Construction go Construction complete. Get them some experience. I wonder why they would do that, though. I guess because they're pacifists and we strictly aren't? I don't know. Fascinating, yes. Mm -hmm. System survey complete. <laughs> Fleeing aggressors. Space amoebers. Battling aggressor station. Fleeing aggressors. Help! There's so many aggressors! Construction complete. This game can be a little much.
There's just a lot going on at any given time. Actually, at this point in the game, quite a windfall of stuff. <laughs> Enough for another science vessel, anyway. Construction complete. Special project complete. System survey complete. Trying to keep track of everything. Construction complete. Ships upgraded. Construction complete. Construction complete. Construction complete. System survey complete. food, but it won't be a problem by the time um, that pop grows in to harvest more. eventually want to look into colonizing another world, but none of them are particularly juicy, so for the time being... Anomaly found! Research complete.
processing is really good because it um, gives a percentage bonus boost to the production of any planet that it's on. System survey complete. Construction complete. Fleeing aggressors. Oh, motherfucker. Enigmatic Fortress. And I managed to save my scientist just in time. Why does this keep happening to me? System survey complete. Fortress is a buggy piece of shit that ruins games, so I'm not gonna mess Anomaly with it. Anomaly found! Construction complete. neighborhood, we can research some of these special projects in the vicinity of our capital. Construction complete. Enigmatic Fortress is another Leviathan-class entity, though it's not a living being, it's a, it's a fortress that's enigmatic. System survey complete. It functions in more or less the same way. It's just like... Unlike the other um, Leviathan class entities you can find. There is a complicated special, special project line. complete. There's a complicated quest line at the conclusion of your fight with it that rarely works like it should. Let's just say that. System survey complete. Construction complete. Construction complete. Oh, another wormhole. This one at least seems to be within our grasp. These, uh, lovely-looking mollusk-type creatures seem to be the artisan troop. I will consider purchasing their services at a later date when I actually have energy.
Anomaly found. Construction complete. Research complete. All right. Um, we can't we can't put it off indefinitely, so we might as well start researching better colony ships. Anomaly found. Construction complete. Construction complete. Alright, so we completed our habitable world survey, so that got us a nice little bonus of System energy. System survey credits complete. And um, society research. System survey complete. Construction complete. Construction complete. Anomaly found. Salvage preserved. Construction complete. Um. I can keep streaming this game. I get way too wrapped up in just trying to keep everything complete. under control and I forget to talk. Might have to find something else to fill up the Thursday slot. System survey complete. 
Research complete. Construction complete. Yeah, I guess I should send out a colony ship pretty soon. Just hoping to find Construction something bigger. Complete. Fleeing aggressors. This say is Emia system, I will remember that. <laughs> Send the fleet to deal with it. Aggressors spotted. Pirates are such a pain in the butt. Construction complete. Construction complete. Research complete. Alright, mineral processing is always helpful. Construction complete. System survey complete. Alright, we've completed a discovery tree, which means that all um, subsequent research we do will be increased by 10%. speed this along, I'm going to pick Technological Ascendancy, so we now have a 20% research bonus. This should speed up our scientific endeavors significantly. One might even say by 20%. Anomaly found! Tile blocker cleared. All right, the pirate fleet exhausted itself by, um, Attacking my uh, star base, so that was a pretty easy clean up. Anomaly operation. found.
The minerals recovered from the pirate strong box. Construction complete. Battling aggressor station. We should probably be able to forward a colony ship, and that will be nice. And this is interesting. I've only had it, had this happen once before. The ISS Archimedes crew is reporting that they found something spectacular on the vast of room 4. On the surface lies traces of an explorative expedition of another civilization. Left behind are some well-preserved documents and artifacts. We can either send it to our homeworld for research or sell it to a private collector. And I'm all about the long game, so I'm gonna send it to the homeworld. System survey complete. Colony ship is under construction. System survey complete. Construction complete. sensors next, just because they're useful in avoiding situations where the science ship gets blown up immediately. System survey complete. Being able to see a couple of systems away is surprisingly useful. Fleeing aggressors. Hostile aliens just sort of squatting in systems I want to explore. Guess it's time to start beefing up the fleet. Anomaly found. Construction complete. Special project complete. Oh, those are just the space whales. I like the space whales. They're harmless, they don't shoot you. System survey complete. Construction complete. Just trying to figure out if that person doing a job before that happened. It doesn't look like it. Alright, what's our... We have a minor mandate again. Wonderful. That 
shell just sort of be filled on its own. Research complete. Construction complete. Jesus, we need to learn how to terraform. Well, at very least, um, this world has exceptionally high quality minerals. Construction complete. Construction complete. System survey complete. Planets will occasionally have special modifiers on them that um, dictate their various attributes, like um, sometimes they have strong mineral qualities, which means that you get more minerals for um, mining there. Sometimes they have poor minerals, which means that you don't. Um, sometimes it will affect habitability or building costs. There's a lot of different modifiers. System survey complete. Construction complete. They can talk, and they want to talk to us. Hello, Otter Hive Mind. Aggressors spotted. What the hell? Get out of my system, Space Amoeba! Special project complete! Construction complete. found. Alright. They are starting to become a problem. Building a new home. Fleeing aggressors. Why are you going towards them? Construction ship taking damage. Construction complete. Well, at least System it survey anyway. complete. found um, by researching that anomaly about the construction and complete society we 
we gained access to a new edict. I believe it was the recycling campaign edict. It will last for 14 years and reduce consumer goods costs by 15%. I would consider enacting it if it wasn't most of our energy reserves. Maybe it was the Improved Energy Initiative. I don't know. I would say that for now, our totals are not really high enough to warrant the usage of such edicts. They're more useful later on. System survey complete. Construction complete. The influence is probably better used for expanding. Construction complete. Anomaly found. I feel like the chances of that happening for the third time in the game is, like, vanishingly small. But we will adapt and we will overcome. System survey complete. Construction complete. We have not one space, but more scientists have died, so that's basically the same Salvage thing. preserved. Aggressors spotted. Research complete. Station under attack. Ships upgraded. Occasionally an admiral will just learn how to manage their fleet more efficiently and get the enhanced something or other bonus. Fleet logistician. 
Construction complete. Oh good, it's a fallen empire. Also, we found a ruined Dyson Spear. Anomaly found! Which is pretty Research cool. complete. Enjoy a good Dyson Sphere. It seems somewhat unlikely that we'll get to it before our neighbors, but who knows? System survey complete. Ships upgraded. Construction complete. We need more Corvettes, or we need to learn how to build destroyers or, or something. Amoebas are wrecking. Construction complete. Anomaly found. <laughs> System survey complete. System survey complete. Tile blocker cleared. System survey complete. Construction complete. <laughs> well, our colony is almost done, so that will make energy production less of an issue. Anomaly found. Got 
our minor mandate fulfilled. Construction complete. System survey complete. So, um, there's an interesting thing about, um, the... Holy Guardians Fallen Empire. Around them, you will find a bunch of different Gaia worlds. Anomaly found. But they New have frontiers special... established. Construction complete. Okay, thank you, announcer. Let me talk for just a minute. Um, but they all have special names. Like Pristine Jewel, Walled Garden, Emerald Mausoleum. And if you settle on one of those worlds, the Guardians will get super fucking pissed at you. So don't do it. It's not worth it. anyway, so the benefit is minimal. Research complete. Alright, let's take a look see at what's going on on our newly newly colonized planet. I will agree to this de defensive pact. have actually colonized another planet, it would be prudent to learn how to clear tiles. System survey complete. Construction complete. Um, Hyperlane breach points is a good technology. It'll take a while to research. Uh, maybe we should do this first. <laughs> it basically just lets you move from system to system quicker. Anomaly found. Construction complete. Construction complete. System survey complete. Oh, Research damn it. complete. I was going to accept that, but it's just sometimes the the notifications for, um... Handshake protocols activated. Fucking hell. The, the notifications for, um, diplomatic stuff sometimes get buried under everything else.
Agree. Please migrate, as much as you wish. System survey complete. Now that I have construction sensors, complete, I'm a little bit more comfortable about queuing up exploration orders. Because if um, the science vessel detects something dangerous in the neighboring system, it just won't go there. and just um, colonize the other. Or actually, maybe I'll just colonize the Gaia world that doesn't have a special title. System survey complete. Well, at least I was on my way there anyway. Construction complete. Anomaly found. And the game will be good enough to let you know. Construction complete. When, um, there's an anomaly or something. Mineral extraction platform lost. Spaceport under attack. Anomaly found. You will occasionally find anomalies with your zero percent- They can talk! And they want to talk to us! Research complete. What was I even saying? You will occasionally find anomalies that, um... have a 0% chance of failure. This usually means that you've found a terraforming candidate. System survey complete. Come back way later. Once the climate restoration technology has been researched. Anomaly found. This game does not give you much of a chance to talk sometimes. Alright, it looks like the hive mind and the theocratic dictatorship have declared a rivalry. That is no concern of mine, really. Thank you. 
Construction complete. System survey complete. Construction complete. Construction complete. because we're sustaining a bunch System of System survey complete. Efforts. Like, we have plenty in the bank, just in case, but... System survey complete. System survey complete. Anomaly found. I do want to... Handshake protocols activated. Sure, I'll do a research agreement. Construction complete. System survey complete. Uh, free space alien civilization on the Pergranon colony in the Vidimar system. Alright, looks like they are in a machine age society. They might blow themselves up soon. I know the probability conundrum is basically just a big waste of time that gets you some influence at the end. So we're just gonna take this as a sign of the divine and move on. Construction complete. System survey complete. Alright, so we have a new faction popping up. The Alien Protection Lobby. They want indirect xenology, no purges, enclaves incorporated, diplomatic traditions, land grab objections, they want to be federated. So we can, we can um, actually make them pretty happy pretty easily. Let's go to the Policies tab. Um, select selective orbital bombardment. That's seemingly somewhat um, bad. <laughs> Passive study on natives. Purges are prohibited. Slavery is prohibited. Refugees are welcome. All species. Open borders. Peaceful. Alright, that should make everybody happy-ish. Construction complete.
anomaly found. Construction complete. System survey complete. Lots of fallen robot societies, evidently. System survey complete. Construction complete. Construction complete. All right, we have way too many aliens that we need to investigate. I'll wait until this is done, and then we can go on a, a special project. Research free. complete. are 26 months out, that's reasonable. Construction complete. Special project complete. have enough um, society system survey complete to just sort of do that easily well met buzzy man tile blocker cleared construction complete special project complete Construction complete. Anomaly found. This will be a pretty huge boost to science. Special project complete. Venerable. System survey complete. Special project complete.
Conduit for the divine or not, it must be studied. Situation log updated. Oh, we found the abandoned gateway. Um, these are things that you can eventually activate and eventually, eventually build to make getting around much easier. complete. Um, long story short is that if you're a xenophile, or I think a pacifist, you can say this knowledge will surely be a great boon to the sciences, and you get a flat plus 10%, um, how do I keep seeing flat plus 10%, that, that's contradictory, you get a, a universal plus 10% bonus to, um, physics research. Construction pretty complete. damn good. They can talk, and they want to talk to us. The Free Quilpulci Commissariat. Um, well, they look unfriendly, so may the spirits bring you to your goals. gonna go ahead and change my advisor back to default. Priority alert. Um, the Xenophile announcer is very enthusiastic, but sometimes I have to talk too. Anomaly found. Special project complete. Alright, now we have access to the Droning Optimizations Edict, which is an extremely powerful edict that increases your mineral production by like 33%. System survey complete. Ships upgraded. Situation log updated. Construction complete.
Construction complete. Anomaly found. Special project complete. Alright, so while most empires get the Void Cloud Buster perk for researching them, we get, as spiritualists, the plus 10% happiness perk for researching the Void Clouds for 240 months. Which is a lot of months. Arguably more useful because eventually Void Clouds just become non-issues. actually um, colonize this planet just yet because it's arctic but the alien toy factory building is a pretty pretty powerful research building that comes pre-equipped on the planet so it's worth it to go there when we can Construction complete. <laughs> System survey complete. buddy buddy with everybody we should adopt the diplomacy tree this will also make our alien protection lobby happy um, the initial effect of this will be that our influence cost for diplomacy stuff is reduced by 50% and our trust growth will be increased by 33% System survey complete. Construction complete. Special project complete. So this is an interesting little um, mini quest. Basically, we can download an alien civilization's neural patterns, and later we might try to revive them in robot bodies. I don't think I've ever actually done this as a spiritualist empire before, so we'll see how it goes. complete. Research complete. Construction complete. Alright, cool. We finally have destroyers. I guess this merits a visit to the ship designer tab. Thank you. 
and we can work on building some of those as time passes. It's always exciting to get a new class of ship available. Construction complete. Anomaly found. The southern half of the galaxy remains mostly mysterious so far. Lots of belligerent alien types blocking the way. System survey complete. Anomaly found. Research complete. Evading hostile fleet. Alright, global energy management is a pretty Colony important technology. It lets you build the energy nexus. Increase the energy uh, produced from a planet like a mineral proce processing plant will. Um, when colonizing new planets, it's good to prioritize um, building gene therapy clinics because that increases growth rate significantly. Construction complete. System survey complete. Research complete. Alright, we have a new revered elder campaign underway. Researching standardized destroyer patterns so we can make them cheaper and pump them out faster. Anomaly found. I have no interest in going to war with anybody at the moment, but something has to be done about these damn space amoebas. Construction complete. Situation log updated. We have re-elected our current ruler. And it's 
another minor mandate, so that will get taken care of. Construction complete. Construction complete. We have a couple of inactive System buildings on complete. the home world, but that's mostly fine. They will get filled in eventually. Construction complete. Anomaly found. Anomaly found. about the eventual takedown of the Aether Drake. Construction complete. So military buildup is always kind of necessary because a lot of life in the in the galaxy is intrinsically hostile. Construction complete. System survey complete. Construction complete. I always just imagine that when you say, um, fascinating or interesting, you do it in, like, the most disinterested, dismissive tone possible. Anomaly found. Um, I'm mostly just grabbing what I Construction want. Construction complete. Research complete. I know that after a certain point, Having too much territory without the science to support it can make your research really slow down. So I'll try not to overexpand, but there's lots of good systems around here that I would like to have. Construction complete. Construction complete.
System survey complete. They'll probably blow something up before my fleet can get there, but whatever. Station under attack. Okay, we fulfilled the minor mandate as... as expected. That is quite the circuitous route. Never mind. Mining station lost. Yeah, yeah. Spaceport under attack. Special project complete. Oh good, we found the curators, who are strange floating potato men. System survey complete. Interesting. Okay, so there is an there's an under underground civilization on one of our planets. Situation log updated. Let's go ahead and try to uh, establish communications. System survey complete. Special project complete. Okay, uh, crisis averted. They're willing to coexist. Anomaly found. Oh, we have an immigrant. Anomaly found. Yeah, eventually we're gonna deal with those space mon space monsters. I just need to beef up the fleet first, and to do that I need to deal with these pirates, and there's so much to keep track of! Search station lost. Among the asteroids is a tree drifting through the emptiness of space, an unprecedented and highly unlikely event. Mm -hmm. 
Send the fleet down there eventually. System survey complete. This technically gets us more, but I actually want more society research than the others. So we'll let the, con the coffin continue its voyage and be respectful, like good space popes. Tile blocker cleared. System survey complete. Construction complete. Research complete. to want um, more naval capacity pretty soon in the interest of beefing up the fleet. So let's go ahead and start researching that. Construction complete. Construction complete. When a ship goes missing complete. in action due to um, an emergency FTL retreat, Anomaly found. Um, it will take about the same time... The, how long it's missing in action is proportional to the distance of how far away it is from a friendly base. We would like to donate. Special project complete. Construction complete. Alright, well, we discovered living metal, which is good. Um, largely useless until late in the game, but still nice to have. Construction complete. System survey complete. An alien empire has established communications. Hello. Construction complete. 
they're far enough away that I don't really care. The two hegemonic imperialists can fight each other. <laughs> Anomaly systems found. that give a lot of energy. Neither of the planets that we've colonized actually give very much, so we need to be mindful. System yeah, I guess I'll complete. research that, but it's too far away to really make use of. Research complete. position to be upgraded. I will probably go into the ship designer and make some adjustments. We can't really realistically have any more ships at the moment. Not until our research is done. System survey complete. Construction complete. Research complete. Anomaly found. Construction complete. So I think I can actually support another construction ship. Something to keep in mind for the future. System survey complete. System survey complete. Construction complete. Construction complete. At some point it might be worth it to trade minerals for energy if they can't find a better source soon. Anomaly found. Construction complete. I need 
as many scientists as I can get, actually. So yes, offer this protege a science officer position. Of course, we will help however we can. I have 100 energy to spare. Construction complete. now have the ability to form a federation. System survey complete. Though we will want to wait until we wait to do this for a little while. Because of some interesting interactions with naval capacity. Construction complete. Um, the conquering of space or the befriending of space. Hello, bird. Um, it, it goes. System survey complete. Space is very complicated, actually. join our colony if that is their wish. It might harm relationships with complete. the underground people, but we also just help them out of a famine, so it should equal out. Construction complete. These subterranean friends are kind of high maintenance, though. They also appear to be tubers. Now that we have a number of different species um, in our empire, it is worth it. to go ahead and make sure that everybody has equal rights. Construction complete. Anomaly found. Construction complete. nuclear bomb, but I think it's fine if they have, like, laser guns.
I mean, this game does actually System allow survey. for that Complete. sort of um, monstrous policy making. Extra protection on the planet. That might be a good idea. Just in case. All right, I gotta, 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 gotta do something about all these a space aliens. Construction out. complete. Ship designer, show me what you can. Lasers. Tile blocker cleared. Lasers tend to be pretty effective against um, spacefaring aliens because they tend not to have Ships shielding. Upgraded. Research complete. Uh, now is probably a good time to do some switching around of scientists. Specialties. Actually, no, I think I'll just have the scientist uh... assist research. I'm sure we will wage a holy war in time. Construction complete. Anomaly found. System survey complete. Construction complete.
All right. Um, we could invite these to a federation if we changed our war philosophy. And I probably will do that eventually. Just want to keep my options open for the time being in case somebody needs a good holy war. I don't anticipate it. Construction but just in case. complete. Looking at these hive minders down here with suspicion. Eventually, our borders are going to touch, and they hate Research that. Research complete. System survey complete. Construction complete. <laughs> Anomaly found. System survey complete. Construction complete. Like a big ass circle. Construction complete. Construction complete. Our economy is proceeding apace, for the most part. System survey complete. System survey complete. an effort to go and um, put a research station over that. System survey complete. <laughs> Just 
just gonna add a few more destroyers to the fleet and then... Evading hostile fleet. Construction complete. Construction complete. Construction complete. Construction complete. The Archimedes is having some issues. System survey complete. And thus had to retreat. Alright, I think it might be time to get the construction ships a rest until I clear out some of these hostile life forms. System survey complete. Construction complete. On the bright side, everybody is inferior to us except for the Fallen Empire. Construction that at the very least complete. does take some worry off. AI empires will usually not start shit if they are not as strong as you. Research complete. Construction complete. System survey complete. System survey complete. Construction complete. Construction complete. Alright, uh, this should be a suitable fleet for our needs. Settle here. It is within acceptable parameters for uh, habitability. Construction complete. Construction complete. Double there. I donated one, so hopefully they're satisfied. System survey complete. Just as not a 
lot of planetary energy in this galaxy, at least not around here. Construction complete. Research complete. trading companies though, so that will increase our energy by a bit. Construction complete. Guys, System survey complete. Hostile fleet engaged. System survey complete. Construction complete. Nebulas are annoying. Even with sensors, you can't really see, unless you have a friendly station there. Debris analyzed. Um, I went ahead and chose, um, whatever it's called, the, the perk that increases habitability, because I am thinking about expanding. support of uh, the current ruler because that's the least amount of hassle. I mean, it doesn't seem... Actually, I should probably just save my influence. They've got a 66% of faction support. Construction complete. Construction complete. Anomaly found.
Research complete. All right, we researched space torpedoes. Which, despite sounding kind of silly, actually are pretty damn good. Construction complete. Oh, I, that was an upset, I guess. Well, it looks like they just automatically replaced it, so it's whatever. What is his mandate? Orbital research mandate. Alright. That should be doable. Very well, resident... Ready the positron charges. We have no energy, but it's fine. Turn the other cheek. That's what a space pope would do. Construction complete. Special project complete. Experiment was a success, and a significant number of dense mineral veins on Triok Ila. Or is that 2A? It's probably 2A. <laughs> Have been transmuted into usable resources. Special project complete. System survey complete. Oh my god, you idiots! Don't just fucking stand in the center of the system, kill them! Anomaly found. Oh, I made, I made an error. I made an error. Well, uh, this world is perfectly nice, too. I forgot that when you get, um, other species in your empire, Construction it complete. also counts their habitation for the little pop-ups for habitation. So I made a, I made a colony ship in the wrong spot.
System survey complete. System survey complete. Colonization in progress. Construction complete. Construction complete. Anomaly found. This game is basically just spinning Evading a bunch of planes. Fleet. have the special project of, well I'm curious what will happen like will we get another one we will interesting let's research the first one and then the second one and see what happens I'm curious construction complete System survey complete. Oh, here's something cool that you can do. We would like your help to found an art college. Now we can build one in the station orbiting their station, and it gives us a lot of unity per month. You can also create one, you can also create a curator think tank if we ever get a curator system in our territory. Construction complete. second fleet we have the capacity and it's it's easier to respond to pirates and shit with multiple fleets and not just having one giant doom stack research complete
Alright, we now have the Hyperlane Breachpoint technology, which means that we can enter and exit Hyperlanes faster, making travel less of a pain. Construction complete. Splendid. Uh, now let's try the second one. Construction complete. At this point, I think I'll just put that science vessel on automated. System survey complete. An interesting dynamic complete. with scientists is... ...that you gain experience faster by surveying systems and stuff than just researching. So it can be beneficial to have a sort of set rotation. I just tend not to remember it very well. Like I said, lots to remember. Construction complete. Anomaly found. Construction complete. Construction complete. System survey complete. We're actually sort of flush with minerals right now, so I'll just help them repair it. Why do they keep giving... What the fuck? This does not seem to be intended behavior. So that event just happened like four times in a row. System survey complete. Research complete. System survey complete. Construction complete. Construction complete. Special project complete. Alright, so I guess that was just a duplicate. Unfortunate. Construction complete. Hmm. 
kann. System survey complete. Construction complete. System survey complete. System survey complete. Colony established. So we have officially gone over our number of directly colonized system limit, so we need to put this in a sector. are mostly autonomous things. They'll sort of manage themselves and grow, though it helps to give them a bit of a boost. So they have System enough minerals to like complete. make things. Construction complete. Research complete. destroyed my fortress. How dare you? System survey complete. Construction complete. Alright, our core sector governor has died, and that merits a replacement. I think I'm 
actually going to go ahead and use the Capacity Overload Edict, just so we can get some healthier energy income. I don't think further expansion is all that um, sustainable right now anyway. System survey complete. Construction complete. Production boosting Construction edicts are super complete. helpful. System survey complete. to stay put, so I don't emphasize getting rid of them as much as the amoebas, which can and will wander into your systems and cause trouble. Construction complete. I also System chose the alien complete. tourism perk because I, I go hard. Construction ship under attack. Okay, fine. Evading hostile fleet. Seems a little weird that a pirate fleet can just kind of materialize in a sector where I have a ship, but so be it. Project complete. Ironically enough, probably quicker just to make a new fleet entirely than wait for the one that's out and about to come back to deal with those pirates. Spaceport under attack. System survey complete. Construction complete. Hello. Oh, I think that's a Marauder Empire. Great. been diligently beefing up my military. They will most assuredly come to cause trouble eventually. Mining station lost. Special project complete. Marauder birds. Basically, Marauder Empires will 
occasionally, at, either at the behest of someone or just because they feel like it, make incursions into your territory and blow shit up. They tend to be quite a bit stronger than you, so sometimes you either have to pay them off or just endure it. Debris analyzed. Construction complete. As you can see, their combined military power is leaps and bounds behind... beyond what probably any of us can do. System survey complete. <laughs> Special project complete. <laughs> System survey complete. So this entire area is basically death. Should probably recall the fleet here. They're taking some hits. Research complete. Search complete. Construction complete. Construction complete. System survey complete. Ah, here we are. Sildor weaklings, our warriors are on their way to plunder your systems. Oh yeah, just have some damn energy. Incoming transmission. Yeah, when you 
when you agree to an exchange of communications at this point in the game, you tend to get flooded by people you haven't met. Construction complete. so inclined you can directly go into your sectors and like um manually queue up projects but it seems like they have things well in hand so carry on friends construction complete construction complete Construction complete. Incoming transmission. Research complete. Most trade deals are um, mutually beneficial, so there's not really any, any compelling reason to refuse them. At least the ones that the AI proposes. Governors, I'm not made of energy. Construction complete. More commerce, people.
Energy for influence is still a good deal. At least in my opinion. Because we can use that influence to expand to places that have more energy, or just um, use the System power survey overload, complete. overload uh, edict. About, um, out of time for today. Construction complete. Okay, I should probably like reinforce my fleets. Construction complete. Construction complete. Pirates love to hide in those little pockets and territory, so I'm just going to expand there. System survey complete. FDL inhibitors are quite useful. Let me just make sure everybody has a project to work on. Construction complete. Um, honestly, this game is kind of, kind of a lot, but the game does a good job of explaining itself, and a lot of the concepts aren't, like, intrinsically complicated. Like, the game has a fairly, um, reasonable rhythm to it. Like there's a lot of a lot of room to learn and grow and get better at optimization and strategy and stuff, but um, just learning the basics and how to play was actually surprisingly not as bad as I thought it would be when I first started. So take from that what you will. Like everybody has something going on, so I'm gonna go ahead and sign off for the evening. Um, I hope you all enjoyed, at least abstractly. I know this game is System sort of complete. a mess. Um, tomorrow we will be continuing on with Subnautica. Construction complete. And then it's the weekend, and I can take a break. Um, until then, I hope you all have a very pleasant evening. If you enjoyed, consider hitting the uh, follow button. And otherwise, I'll talk to you all later. Bye-bye. <laughs>